What's up? This is Monkey D. Ryan. We'll be going through uh, chapter 384 of My Hero Academia. And my god, am I loving The Last War. So let's go. A roaring scream. Oh, Giganto Machia. Just yoink an entire mountain or hill or something, I guess. And screams out. This is risky. Did Shinso brainwash him into fighting on our side? Yeah, that's what we've bet That that's what we've bet on. Mountain ladies protecting Makia, but I was wondering how the Aoyama family managed this to deceive me. So this is the answer: a manipulation court. Hitoshi Shinso's brainwashing can be broken by a strong physical attack. That's just some, just that's just like something I would do. Oh, he's he's even growing more younger. Each minute that passes, if AFO breaks his hold, Makia will once again obey him. You look different, but my sense. Oh no! Shit, the, the, the happiness I felt was so short-lived. That's right. Uh, the, the... How should I say this? The bra uh, Shinzo's brainwashing quirk can be easily uh, countered with a large amount of pain like we've seen in the UA festi sports festival. My sense of smell tell tells me it's you all for one. My master, I've been waiting for you. Why did you abandon me? Is Shinso forcing Makia to speak like he did with the Aoyamas? That can't be. He didn't have a chance to brainwash Makia again, so what's going on? My beloved Makia. Unfortunately, I have to go into hiding, but eventually my successor will come looking for you. Having to leave your side breaks my heart into pieces. While the body of your successor, of the successor that found you was different, he still had your voice and your smell. I can tell. It was really you all for one. I trusted your words and waited so long, but you abandoned me, master. You never came back. Oh, okay. So there's distrust already? What's happening here? Are, you, are those tears that I see? Okay. What's happening here? First Midoriya, now Makia. They're the only one. They're the only two to ever resist my brainwashing. Even when I had Makia under my control, he was me. Ah, muttering about being betrayed. That's the reason why I bet on his anger, anger and gave him plenty of time to dwell on it. I'm just here as a safety measure. A lot of people say I act like a villain, but my quirk has absolutely no control over what goes on in someone's heart. That's so true, let's go! It, look, it looks like no one wants to read a story about the demon lord. Let's go! Oh my god, Mountain Lady! She's just... Oh my god. W, w woman. Let's go! We need to keep attacking until he rewinds into oblivion. Oh, everyone's just going ham at him! Let's go! We have to make sure we don't get in their way. Yeah, that's why I'm... I brought our most expensive camera. We'll zoom in from afar. Boarding a helicopter in this kind of weather. Did you lose your mind or something? Right back at you. I can't explain why. It's just something I have to do. I'm a reporter through and through. Hey, take a look at this. That boy dresses in rags was a UA student all along. I thought I recognized him. So I, lock I, I locked. I looked through my old footage. 
and it turns out I'd met him even before the sports festival. To think that such a timid boy could change so much in just one year. Let's go, Midoriya! <laughs> oh my god, Chigaraki's laughter here is just... Just emanates craziness and madness. It's so good! Seems we're not the only ones who felt like they had to do something. A helicopter and these winds? I'm sorry for dragging you along with me. I made this choice free of my, of my own free will. This just goes beyond journalism. I need to undo the damage I caused. It's not professional. It's personal. Oh no, everyone! Everyone is coming back into the story and I am loving it. This time we owe it to ourselves. It's the same for them. It's the same for them. Zuko Midoriya isn't alone on the battlefield. Even though they saw their comrades give up and walk away, some of them had chosen to fight, to stand and fight. Because they're heroes. It's been reported in many countries that Japan has been defeated. But there are still people here who haven't given up. And we're here to tell that story. And that's what we'll do. Regardless of whether we win or lose. And that's so great. Everyone. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. But I, I'm really loving how Horikoshi is uh, weaving all these characters together. And making them each have their own individual roles in this war. And not just making it seem like everything is just on um, Deku's shoulder. Because it's not. Because everyone in society has a place to fulfill. And they have a role to, to do for ev everything to function correctly. And I am loving how in the first... In the... In the the, in the past couple of chapters, we've got Gentle, we've got La Brava, we've got uh, Lady Nagant, we've got the people from the business course, um, we've got people from the support, from the support course, now we've even got the reporters, and I, I, I don't know, it, it just feels so good how how this war is not about Deku just being the hero but everyone becoming the hero and oh yeah there's even s multiple reiterations of this like um, that chapter title where in the story of how we all became heroes and that that theme just continuously it's just continuously being re-emphasized over and over again. And seeing it all come to fruition is just so good to see. Okay, I've rambled on a bit longer <laughs> than I should have. But now I'll, I'll move on to the next page. Every day, the world seems smaller and more connected. So let's record what happens next. Gentle's heroic and chivalrous channel. Viewers! 7,600, 20,000, 306. Show it all to the small world. Where is Japan? Isn't that All Might's country? They need to know that it's not over yet. Oh no, everyone in the, in the world is watching. This is so cool. Oh, oh, no way. It's, it's Melissa. And and the it's Melissa from the first movie and and the kids the kids from from the second movie is is the guy from the third movie here? No? Ah oh, shit no. But still though It feels so good seeing everyone just everyone from France uh, for, uh Egypt, USA. This 
this is just so amazing. It's it's just this war is becoming so much more than I initially thought. It's it's bringing on the spirit of one for all. And right now, everyone is relying on Deku to not just because the the cornerstones of this war is not just reliant on Deku and Shigaraki. There's also all for one. We've even got um, Dobby in the mix with uh, Endeavor. And I'm not sure what... Oh, we also got uh, Ochako and... Ochako and Toga. So, there's a lot of corner... Uh, key... Key points in this battlefield and it doesn't feel like there's just one single battle that's more important than the other and everyone has a role to play and i just find it so beautiful and i guess that's all for my reaction for this chapter chapter 384 and i'm just loving my hero right now